live from San Diego, this is the Fox 5 Morning News at 7. And then we are going to meet the local teenager raising thousands of dollars to help families in need. A local girl has raised thousands of dollars to help build a home for a family in Mexico. Listen up here, people. This is how this, this is how you do it. She's only 14 years old, Daniela Benitez. Good morning, Daniela. Mm -hmm. Welcome, Good welcome. Morning. Uh, we were just telling you, you know, when I was 14, I was playing Nintendo. When she was 14. <laughs> Who remembers what she was doing? Yeah, like but good for you. Tell me what this is all about. You're you're building, you're helping raise money to build a house for a family in Mexico. How did this all come about? Well, last year I went with my school and we went and raised all the money and went to build a house. And after going to Mexico and seeing their living conditions, so they were living in like one little shack, a family of five. Mat one mattress on the floor, you know, the little girl showing us she sleeps on the dirt floor. When it rains, it pours inside of their house and they all get soaked and they have no running water, no bathroom. So after seeing that with my own eyes, it really impacted me and made me want to go and keep helping. And so the next morning I told my mom, you know, I want to build my own house and raise the money myself with all our family and friends. Wow. So I got together 16 people that I love and that I knew would help me and we all raised a thousand each. I think I need to talk to your mom after this segment <laughs> and take some notes on oh how my, my kids and my daughter can uh, make that same because that's usually not what you hear from a 14 year old uh, who does that. Okay, so you're working with Build a Miracle. Yeah. What do they do exactly? How do, how do they help in this? So Build a Miracle is a nonprofit that takes people that are willing to raise the money and so they get donations of sixteen thousand dollars so i was emailing back and forth with you had to get sixteen thousand yes so if you got sixteen thousand they organize everything wow. they would oh this is great let's do this yeah okay and then um how long did it take you to raise that money um it took two months so over the summer we raised all the money and look then at you i turned it into mrs north she's the build a miracle person and we just worked together to organize all the dates and we went and built. It gives you a little perspective when you went and, and, and you saw how other people live in other parts of the world and you come back home and it's like, wow, we're so lucky here. Yes. We're so lucky. You kind of understand why people want to come to the U.S. Mm -hmm. uh, from those circumstances. Uh, not only did you help raise this money, but then you're like, you know what? Do you know how to use a hammer? I mean, I guess you do now. <laughs> I'm going to go there and help actually build this house. What was that like for you? Going and building it was really amazing because instead of just putting our money towards something, we got to actually go and see where yeah, it goes yeah. and see, you know, how much this is changing yeah. the family's life. And we get to be with the family and they actually help us build. And I was talking to one of the families when we were there on Saturday yeah. and they said, you know, it's not only amazing that you guys are raising all this money, but that you guys are down here getting your hands dirty with us. Because right. everybody can write a check, yeah. everybody can feel bad and raise money and then disconnect, but you're like all in. I'm like, yeah. okay, here's the money. Now I'm going to come. What's your fa Did you know how to work with, with tools and hammers and things like that before? So again, Build a Miracle, they organize everyone to come and yeah. help us and all the families in Mexico, they come and help. And we made cement from scratch till we get the cement and make that and pour that. And then we go back the third time. Someone goes in between to hammer oh and God, stuff. You're pouring cement? <laughs> we go back the third time and paint it and add in furniture. Okay, yeah. So I'm, I have a bunch of questions. Yes. This is, this is, she always does. How long, how long did it take you to build it? About three months. Three months. And how many times did you have to go back? Twice. Just twice. Where was it in Mexico? Um, in Tijuana. Okay, so you just drove over with your family and then... You're do, making do, Daniela feel like she's going to get no, tested no, on this no, later. No, like, I'm like, getting tested. I'm getting notes. information because if this is... Um, you know, if a 14-year-old <laughs> can do this, it makes me excited that there might be somebody else, like another yeah. youngster who's watching right now and says, I can do this. I can raise $16,000. So I want to see how you know, doable. You know, Hold on, I have more questions. Three months, <laughs> twice, Tijuana. And then how often, when you when you went there, oh, yeah, you stay yeah, yeah. one time or uh, one night or two nights? How long did we you go? We just go during the day. So 7 a.m., we meet somewhere. Yeah. We all go over together. And you spend the day building out. And okay. we finish by 4 o'clock let me, let me ask you something. We're Were you going. surprised because... Again, in San Diego, you hear about how expensive the housing is, mm -hmm. and every house is so. And then you realize 
all it takes was $16,000 and you make that difference in somebody's life and you build an entire house for them. For that amount of money, was yeah. that just shocking to you based on what it cost to live in San Diego? Just I, across the border? It really does. It's crazy how much of a difference there is right? across the border and how you go over there and you see how poor everything is and then I get to come back to my house and I just yeah. feel so lucky. I know. Wow. And it's so easy to do it there. So if I could, I'd love to do it here one day, but it's yeah. a little more difficult. Did you meet the, you met the family after their house was built? Yeah. And what was it like for you? Oh, this, look at this. <laughs> oh my goodness. Yeah. Look at the mom and the kids. Look what you do when Wait you a see. Come on, Daniela, you didn't tell me you brought this video. Now we, need, <laughs> when, now we need tissue. When you see this and you see the impact that you've made 14, I, I can just imagine what you're gonna do in the future. What is that like for you to see that? Look at this. Yeah, I got to see her on Saturday again, and Aww. it's crazy how much of a difference there is. They're so much happier. Oh, no, 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 <laughs> don't cry. Oh. <laughs> Daniela. I can't with this, Daniela, I can't with this. You know, we're very emotional. <laughs> We are. We love we really good people, are. and especially at a young age. Thank you for, for being amazing. Thank, Thank you. Wait a minute. For, I want, what? before she leaves, because what? this is something special here. Yes, yes. If, if you could talk to, to I was going to say talk to other kids. Yes. But I'm going to say just talk to other people, Including even grown ups. ups. What would you tell them about how you could just care for other people so much that you would want to oh, do something? Oh, good like question. That? What would you tell? Go ahead, that's your camera. I would probably say that. A big part is just being inspired, so you have to find something that inspires you and that you're passionate about. And once you find that thing, it'll really drive you to do anything you want. Daniela? That's it. Can I vote for her? Are you running for governor? What is happening? <laughs> Thank oh you for God. being here. Thank you for having uh, me. You can support Daniela. We do have a link on FoxSideSanDiego.com. Click the scene on tab. She'll build more houses. She'll do amazing things. Maybe one day, I run mean, for the president of the United <laughs> States. Is your mom here? I mean, no. yes, yeah, mom. Can we it. talk in commercial break? I need some notes. It's I have like you. it's cool, but you're, you know, Where's you're 14, mom? and it's good for you. But then, as ma as parents, <laughs> we always wonder. Well, did, is this? Has she always been like this, mom? Just thumbs up or thumbs, thumbs down? Up. She's always been kind of this generous. Oh. <laughs> I love it's it. Like, how do you do that? But like, how do you raise a kid like this? Daniela, how do you raise a kid like you? I don't know. <laughs> okay, well, all right, we'll try to take notes. Uh, thank you so much. Thank keep, you. Keep going. Keep doing what you're doing. Thank it's really you. awesome.